<laughs> Welcome back. It's a one-day event that allows young girls to learn and explore the different branches of science while doing hands-on activities with Daddy. Here to tell us a little bit more about NDSU's Dads and Daughters, Do Science and Why It's So Important, we have Danny and Anne with the NDSU Society of Women Engineers. Thank you, ladies, Thank for you. coming in today. First, uh, this is so exciting that we have two ladies strong, uh, <laughs> you know, because we talk a lot about STEM and getting all kids involved, but especially young women. So talk a little bit about your this program, Daughters and Dads. What do you think about that? Well, I really like this program because um, as a little girl, I did programs like this with my dad, but um, engineering is a very male-dominated field. So what we like to do is get the younger generation of girls to know that STEM-based careers are possible, and we like to set examples as engineers ourselves. Yeah, because you have pretty big ambitions. We, uh, Chris asked you in the break what you want to do when you graduate. Yeah, um, I want to make medical devices um, uh, just so I can help people improve their quality of life. That's so. incredible, a great goal. And you're still deciding, but you're in the right field and you have some time to decide. Yes. So many options. For sure, yeah. Okay, well tell us a little bit more about this program. And have you guys been involved in this in the past? Uh, yes, this is a program we do every year. Um, we also have several different programs, but this um, Dads and Daughters Do Science, this program in particular, it's with dads and their kindergarten through second grade daughters. Okay. It's a one-day event. Um, and it's three hours long, and we have many activities planned by Danny, which is our outreach chair for K through second grade. And it's a hands-on event to get girls excited about engineering. Uh, and Chris, you know, you're super science focused, super right? Super science. <laughs> Actually, Isabella's is kind of like she's into the robotics program, so she. But it's only kindergarten through second grade, or yeah, this activity here for dads and daughters do science. Is K through second. We have other outreach events like Tech Kids and stuff that's like a one day a week event. For I was say, my daughter, my 10 year old did Tech Kids, kids. and so yes. yeah, so they're all different ages, but so age appropriate then in case, because I was getting a little intimidated that, you know, who knows what you guys are going to have us do today, but you have an example of something that will be happening at this event? Yes, uh, Danny will show us right now what yeah. we'll make. So this here we have Ublik, so when you kind of touch it, it's hard, but then you kind of can pick it up and it kind of slimes wow. out. Wow. So that's kind of fun. The Kids heck? always love that. Yeah. And then we're going to make some slime today, so it's just kind of equal parts glue and shaving cream here. So what did you call that over there, Ublik? Ublik, yes. It's kind of fun. It's a fan one, yeah. favorite, Ooh, yes. Like. And then we'll just put some shaving cream in here, and then we'll mix it up. The spoon, do you want to mix it with the sure. spoon? And that's it? And then we'll add some, we actually do add some Tide or just some laundry detergent. We'll make this one blue. How about that? And then, so it starts to stick together a little bit with the glue. And then we'll add some of this. And it'll start coming together a little bit more. What was that? That's just some laundry detergent uh. there. And then we'll add, so it makes it kind of stick together. And then we'll actually add some contact solution. And it kind of holds it and so it doesn't stick to your hands. So like when I pick it up here, I can. Yeah. Nice. So yeah. So when did you guys both realize, oh, you've got a strong affinity for science and engineering kind of stuff? I've always liked the problem solving aspect of the engineering department. And like from since I was a kid, I like to build things and put things together. <clears throat> so. Okay, so I mean, this is slime, right? We're yep. making slime. It's kind of fluffy slime. Fluffy slime. Yeah. So talk a little bit more because slime that. has been like so popular. But I don't know when I've made slime at home that I've necessarily discussed with my girls how it's all working. Is that part of what's going to be like understanding how this all becomes like this, Yeah, just right? the different chemical yeah. properties. How are, we, how are we making this? This is another yeah, that's slime, a yellow right? one. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> I'll pull out some slime. I mean, so can you explain? You just showed us that, but how, how does, really good. How does <laughs> it work? I mean, how do you, the, the ingredients, how do they play together um, to create this like amazing, <laughs> all kids are obsessed with slime? Just the different chemical properties that just putting them together and just your household items. Just like that. I guess we can go more into that. I don't know. I have to go to class then. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> well, we do talk about how this event in part, this project in particular, is related to chemical engineering, and then we'll oh. also have things related to industrial engineering, mechanical engineering, civil engineering. There's different types of activities we plan that are for each um, discipline of engineering. Have you had any great experiences that stand out between, you know, maybe questions from the kids, questions from the dads? What kind of, you, when you're there and seeing them, this is like, you know, you could probably do this in your sleep or with your eyes closed. 
What kind of great stories do you get from this kind of program? Well, some of the girls that come in are also have like done a lot of this stuff before, and sometimes it's new. And a lot of the times, the dads get more excited about like the <laughs> rockets and stuff that we do. We're gonna do a baking soda rocket this year at Dad's. Actually, it's very similar to like the volcano rockets that you've all seen before. Yeah. So they nice. just kind of more of the bigger. When, when is that event? <laughs> this is at Dad's, so April 13th. All right, good. Oh, I love so. it. How do people get signed up then? Um, you go to www.ndsu um, slash COE slash outreach, and you will scroll down to the K through 12th grade offerings. And there you can see all our programs we offer, actually. But if you want to sign up for Dads, just click on the Dads. This program is actually free this year, which is a first for wow. us. We have okay. amazing sponsors, CNH Industrial, right here in... in Fargo has um, planned to um, sponsor a program because they, they like it so much. <laughs> I love this. And just before you go then, why would you encourage dads and daughters to do this and do this together? Um, um, encourage your girl that um, anything is possible, that whatever they set their mind to, you can do. And engineering is one of those things that it, uh, you can strive to be. Yeah, I mean, look at you two. This is know, amazing. Right? Great it. examples for our young girls as oh, well. Thank, thank you. you so much yes, for coming in. It's so fun to visit with you guys. All right, stay with us coming up here on North Dakota Today. High school performances that you can check out this weekend for a good cause.